it's time to go to work. That's what the Apostle Paul says in 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 58. If we've been saved by grace and we appreciate that salvation in light of the resurrection of Christ, which means our own resurrection, he says it's time to go to work. We do not work to get saved, but we ought to be so appreciative that we are saved that we don't mind working for the Lord. He gives us a mandate. The mandate is to toil for the Lord. I mean, we toil for everything else in life that we really want. We really want God to be glorified, his kingdom to be advanced, and people to be benefited. And that requires work. But he says the motivation for it ought to be the grace of God. He tells us in Ephesians 2, 8, 9, we're saved by grace. But then he says in verse 10, having been saved by grace, we're saved for work. So we have to raise the question, are we really giving God the work, the service that he deserves as kingdom servants? After all, our Christian life is not a cruise ship where you have crew, a crew and guests. It's a battleship where everybody's the crew and everybody is involved in serving. So he gives us a mandate for service. He gives us a motivation based on the good news of the gospel for service. And then he gives us the methodology. He wants us to be steadfast. That is, not bouncing all over the place. He reinforces that, immovable. That is having a steady foundation based on biblical conviction that's not just bounced around based on what's happening in the culture. And then he says, always abounding, not giving God the minimum but going over and above. That's what abounding means in the work of the Lord. And the good news about that verse is that you're not wasting your time. He says your labor is not in vain in the Lord. So you're not wasting your time when you give God some of your time, some of your talents, and some of your treasures for His glory, the advancement of His kingdom, and the benefit of others. When that comes together as a lifestyle, God does not miss your labor of love. So it's time to go to work. Let's serve the Lord because he's worthy.